It's a victory for Prime Minister Kaya Kalas's Reform Party, with 31.6% of the vote, against only 16% for their far-right rivals in the ECRA party. Kalas's last government was one of the most staunchly pro-Kiev in Europe, with military support amounting to 1% of GDP, continuing this policy as at the heart of the party's manifesto. We have to uh, do uh, major reforms regarding uh, green transition, for example, but we also have to invest in our security. Our aggressive neighbour has not uh, vanished and will not vanish. Estonia shares a land border with Russia and spent 50 years under Soviet occupation. So many voters see supporting Ukraine as the best way of guaranteeing their own security. The ECRA party leader was quick to reject the result. My first reaction is that I don't uh, believe and I don't trust uh, the um, electronic voting and I don't think it's, uh, it reflects the actual will of the uh, voters. His party is in favour of reining in support for Ukraine and their campaign focused on the economic repercussions of the war amid rising living costs and high inflation. But the Reform Party has won with a bigger margin than expected and Kallas is confident that she will be able to continue her pro-Ukraine policy in her next coalition.